A treehouse, that's down close to around 20%, pending sell orders as well. Z-Learn as well as reeling under pressure as Z-Learn has withdrawn um, from the proposed merger. Manglam is uh, here with us to tell us all the details between these two companies from the time really they first announced that merger a year ago. Manglam, take it away. Indeed, indeed, Nigel. It was exactly a year ago on uh, December 23rd, 2015, when the merger was announced. Remember, Treehouse at that point was grappling with a lot of issues with regards to the promoter's pledge, and that is when Z-Learn came in to help the company. At that time, the ratio was roughly five shares of Z-Learn for one share of Treehouse, and that is something that the price at that point also reflected, where Treehouse was trading at around 206 rupees, where Z-Learn was trading at 41 rupees per share. But then again, after using the proceeds uh, to re revoke the pledge on the promoter's stake by Treehouse on March 12th, one fine day, Treehouse promoters went ahead and pledged their entire stakeholding in the company itself. Around 20% is what they held at that point in time. And uh, coupled with some uh, underperformance of the stock price, at the same time, underperformance of the numbers of Treehouse, uh, we will, which we will come to later, the Z-Learn announced to the exchanges on June 2nd that the merger has then been put on hold. And that point in time, Treehouse, which traded at 206 in December, is currently was currently trading at 61 rupees, as against Z-Learn which was trading at 29 rupees. August 17th, Z-Learn came out with another revised swap ratio at 1 is to 1, which was again reflective of the current market prices of the stock prices or, or, or of both the stocks at that point in time where Treehouse and Z-Learn were trading around that 30 rupees uh, per share mark. But then again, on December 16th, which is Friday, Z-Learn informed the exchanges that they have cancelled the merger plans with Treehouse on reports that Treehouse will shut or has shut 113 schools due to the due to the cash crunch and now if you look at the treehouse uh, treehouse share prices versus zlearn treehouse at that point was trading at 23 and a half rupees versus zlearn at 40 rupees so it was clearly some weakness going on in treehouse's numbers because if you look at it treehouse today also has not clearly inform the exchanges whether they've shut the school or not. Instead, they are saying that, uh, you know, exit of Z-Learn was a part of conspiracy to destroy the competitor. Financial mess of the company was artificially created by SL Group. Those lines should come up for you right now. And they have also informed the exchanges that SL Group had indeed illegally attempted to take over the company. But take a look at the facts. Over the last one year that I spoke about, we had four quarters. And in the three quarters that you will see, uh, you have uh, the financials uh, flashing for both of y'all, both of the companies, Tree, Treehouse's uh, 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 net losses fell from 30 crores in the fourth quarter of FY16 to 48 crores in the most recent quarter, while Z-Learn has only improved at an annual quarterly rate of uh, close to 8 crore rupees on the profit, uh, uh, on their profit or bottom line. At the same time, even if you look at the cash, the cash crunch is something that was reported by the papers, but this is something that we've been pointing out as well. The cash has disappeared from 151 crores to 8.6 crores in just a period of one year. So these are are things we really need to keep in mind. Treehouse has been saying that SL Group is artificially creating uh, uh, the financial mess in the company, but we need to keep in mind the company has reported numbers, and most importantly, the collective intelligence of the stock market says if you look at the both price performance of uh, both the companies, Z Learn was around uh, 40 rupees a year ago, still 40 rupees right now. Treehouse, in, on the other hand, has fallen from 206 rupees to just 23 rupees, and these are things we need to keep in mind. Okay, Mangalam, thank you so much for that exhaustive and very informative link, yes.